It is freaking 5.22 and my flight leaves at 6.35 and our airport is like an hour away. So, you girl stressed. Oh gosh, and it's five o'clock traffic. I'm freaking terrified. We'll stay, just take a leap of faith. We'll find a way for you and me. Can't look back, can't run from what I feel inside. There's no more time to hide because I. First and foremost, apologize for my crappy vlogging so far. Um, it's been a mess. It's been real. It's my first time vlogging with this little camera. Sorry, I look an absolute mess. My hair, the stocking cap is glued down. That's how I know y'all be, be real ones because I be showing you guys looking like a damn mess. I do kind of like a little chatty get ready with me portion, I guess, because actually I probably shouldn't do this because it's going to make my vlog really long. But I just wanted to check in with you guys and talk to you guys really quickly about, I guess, what had happened. So, I just, the first clip you probably saw in the car of me and my boyfriend. Um, that's why I didn't vlog at all. I really, literally, so my, as you guys know, I'm on the track team. And my coach was super, super kind and let me leave a day early um, because the flight prices jumped like crazy. It was like 5.54 and my flight left at 6 already. But luckily, I live in a small area. And the airport's pretty small, but it was hella busy, of course. And that was what I was hoping. I was like hoping that it would be dead because I was like, oh, I've never done an evening flight. Hopefully it's chill. No, that was the busiest I've seen in my airport at least. So the bags were checked. I went sprinting down to security. And I, again, it was another really big line. And I'm, I'm like tearing up, shaking like crazy. My boyfriend had told me to just ask people if you can go in front of them, which I have never done that before. Well, I've never been that late to a flight before, so I've never had to really do that. But I started, I pulled up my boarding pass on my phone and I was like, my, it was like at 6, it was 6.20 at that time. And then my flight left at 6.30 and I was in the back of the line of security. And literally you guys, like 20 people let me cut them. It was so nice. Like I wanted to cry. And I was just like, oh, thanks guys. That's basically what it was happening with me and why I wasn't vlogging because my, my boyfriend kept saying, oh, we can try and vlog this, try and vlog this. God, I was in a mess. I was a mess. We went to Medusa last night. Um, that's also I was going to check with you guys and I'm going to insert clips from my snapchat because that's the first thing I've noticed about being here in Atlanta Not many people snapchat or film or vlog So I can't wait to get to LA because I won't feel as awkward. But it, was, it was really dope It was a lot smaller than I expected but Quavo was there. Quavo and Offset and I was pissed because Cardi didn't come. I came with you guys since I didn't do any vlogging yesterday But I'm here until Tuesday, so I still have Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. Yeah, four more days. So yeah, I will talk to you guys when I get some more. Ta-da! <laughs> Hello guys, I'm about to go outside really quickly. Um, I just got ready and my Lyft is on its way. Yo, I want to set up you guys really quickly. Y'all need to download Lyft instead of Uber because look at this. Well, He's actually outside right now. It doesn't even show, but basically my, my lift was 29 cents. And I want to tell you guys that because that shit's crazy. But I'm about to head outside.
lighting is, but just got back from the mall. I just did some vlogging. Um, this is my first time, not my first time in a bigger area, but I actually got told to put my camera away twice, so I didn't really take it out too much. And also I was with my friend and I don't know, I always, I keep forgetting to vlog. Like I took a little clip um, when we were at lunch, but I don't know why, I just keep forgetting to vlog, I'm so sorry. But luckily I'm gonna compile all my footage into one vlog from every day. So um, it'll be good, like all together because it's over like five days. <sighs> Come from the mall, I have like four bags of stuff in here. That's why it's all, it's huge. Um, but yeah, we went to come in the mall and I want to go to Linux, but it's already, I guess, 5.30, which is just so weird, but apparently there's like a lot of traffic and it's getting my nails done, but considering I went to one store and spent $100, now I'm like, maybe I won't. <laughs> These are actually still press-on nails. I was really wanting to get some acrylics, but it kind of makes sense not to because these haven't fall these aren't falling off. They're like, they're doing really well. And if they do fall off that, I'll be really upset. The only issue with this kind of haul is always stores, which I was, this is one of my favorite things when it comes to shopping, is finding stores that aren't chain stores. So it's not like Forever 21. I went crazy. <laughs> um, I mean, I really didn't buy all that much. I bought, um, this I kind of was mad at myself for buying, but it's really, really cute. It's a camo two piece set. I bought three sets, which is annoying, but I couldn't help myself. So I bought three sets. Um, the first is just like, it's a bando top. I really wish I had it in a small, but they only had it in a medium. But I mean, it still fits, it's fine. But you cinch the bottom up. And then I bought the matching camo joggers to go with it. And it's so freaking cute. I already have two pairs of camo joggers. And so I don't want to buy a third pair, but obviously these like match perfectly. And the other, other camos that I have, they wouldn't match. This is like, um, I would show you guys, but I can't fucking get it. This is like my Louis backpack would look really cute. And sorry, lighting's kind of weird. The lighting in this room is awful. And um, right now I'm just trying to do this really quickly with the sunlight, the little bit of sunlight that I have where to put it on. But these are so fucking cute. I'm so excited for this. This is another another um, two piece, but it, it's just like a um, cropped hoodie. But then the sleeves look like, it's, kinda, it's hard to explain. And it has like this little, band that hangs off it and the pants are joggers and the band stops and also has a, a cut in the knee this just looks so dope you guys i hated this i don't know why but i really like it this reminds me of like the motorsport like motorsport slash wetsuit kind of thing but it's just like a boy short jumpsuit it has like a little you know splats in the middle i'm ordering some louboutin those combat boots and I think I'll look really dope with this. Um, I don't have a lot of ideas with this one. I feel like this was like sneakers and like hair in a bun. I don't know, it's just really flat. I went to was called Viv by, and I only got one, or I got two things, but kind of like one thing. It's another two piece set, but it's just a spaghetti strap top that was like 10 bucks. It's just white, it has a, or black, it has a white stripe down the side. And then the matching leggings, which again are just black with a white stripe. The leggings were 13, the top was 10. And those are the prices that I like. Um, which I've never been to one before. I just got two t-shirts, like it's just a Coca-Cola t-shirt. And then this one reminded me of like, is it Banana Republic or is it like PacSun? I don't know. I'll talk to you guys when I do something next, I guess. <laughs>that I suck, I mean, I know. That's last night at the club. It was a little bit easier this club because it was definitely more of a club versus like a lounge, but I still didn't get that much. I didn't even take my camera with me, I took my phone and I was trying to vlog a little bit there, but it is raining. 
as you guys can see, and I'm literally heartbroken. I'm really hoping I can like find some friends at Linux. I'm about to go there right now because I literally have nothing else to do, and I haven't eaten yet, and it's like, what time it is? It's like 11.30. I'm trying to stop Postmating. Postmating and Uber Eats is like the awesomest thing, but you bitch will go broke so quickly. That's one thing I hate about traveling with me is I eat a lot and it sucks because I always gotta pay for it. And we went to the Cheesecake Factory yesterday, which I took a little bit of vlog footage there and my meal was like 40 bucks. <laughs> so I didn't even get cheesecake, which is annoying. But also let you guys know if you like my quality. It just looks, in the viewfinder, it looks really nice. I can't really tell. But yeah, I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Yo, look at my Airbnb. An absolute wreck. I got a really, really cheap one. Um, so there's like really nothing special here, just really just a bed and a place to stay. you guys so I just made it to Lenox Mall I'm trying to figure out where I want to go eat but yeah I just sat down really quickly <laughs> I'm kind of overwhelmed because this mall is freaking huge like as you guys saw in my little montage thing it was raining earlier as you guys saw too and now it's like really hot and humid which is good because I'm wearing like, this little like motor, motor suit motorsport uh, inspired jumpsuit thing I like to call it, it looks like a wetsuit to me but yeah, I'm gonna I'm try and find food first because I'm really hungry. I haven't eaten anything today. I'm gonna go to Cheesecake Factory and I'm gonna talk to you guys in a little, a little bit. Gonna do something a little bit more fun. I am going to do a photo shoot. <laughs> it looks so great. I'm gonna do a photo shoot. My phone's really oily. So this camera is so nice, but it exposes me and I already look bad. Like I just rub my eyes and yeah. I think I'm just gonna go through and clean up really quickly and then heat up some leftovers and then take a shower and try and get ready as fast as I possibly can. What is up you guys? I'm so proud of myself. I'm actually gonna vlog. But um I just got ready. I can't this oh there we go. I just got finished or just finished getting ready and my Uber's on its way, so I'm about to go to my shoot. Super excited. Like I said, I told you guys it's in a penthouse. And I've seen it in pictures, but like it looks like it's tall as brick. So I feel really bad though because the photographer, I asked him to push the shoot back because I woke up so late and didn't really want to rush. I went to make sure I had time to eat and I post made it some Starbucks and stuff. And now I'm still pretty sure I'm gonna be late because it's 2.36 and I'm taking an Uber pool, which I probably shouldn't have did that. But it was cheaper, but they're not even, so they're arriving in eight minutes and it was saying, hopefully no, hopefully no one else like, it's picked up on the way. Fingers crossed. I'm sorry about me wearing my hair up in like literally the past like million vlog clips I've taken. I haven't, this is a 360 frontal and um, I've never had them before but I'm obsessed with it. It's definitely a lot more hectic and a lot more like um, maintenance, I guess. I really, really like it. So I said to leave my hair up. Every time I do a photo shoot, I always like to do a different look than I normally do. I will get back to you guys when I'm in the Uber and then when we get to the penthouse.
what is up you guys so just got to Benihana sorry I didn't really vlog too much at the shoot I will insert some clips hopefully I have them by the time I'm edit this vlog but I'll insert some clips of the actual like footage it was kind of like a video slash photo shoot sort of thing so Benihana I have my reservation is in a couple minutes so I'm gonna I want to say hi to you guys really quick before I go in and do a quick outfit of the day so my t-shirt just says queen it looks like the Gucci t-shirt. I actually bought it from Ided on her Poshmark because she has the cutest clothes and she's always selling shit. I love her. I bought stuff from her so many times. I'm wearing these leather pants. And I'm wearing some BCBG heels. They're just plain black strappy heels and my YSL purse. Hope I can get a cute pic because I love my outfit and hair and everything and my little choker. Um, purchase this shit was from Amazon but yeah go ahead and go inside and I'll see you guys in there I just got back to the Airbnb. Um, the lighting's terrible. That's I kind of didn't want to do my vlogging, but I feel like I've been doing so bad this trip. So I'm trying to catch up a little bit in the last few days and show you guys a little bit more fun stuff. Um, but yeah, I went to Benihana. It was really fun. I have a cute Instagram picture for you guys. So you guys should follow me on Instagram if you don't. We're actually not going to go out tonight. Thank God. We've been going out every single night since I got here. And honestly, like it's fun. But I am a grandma. But honestly, I really like Atlanta because I love how it's it's like it's such a good mixture. It's like there's we were I was downtown Atlanta um today and I was also in Buckhead. It is fucking beautiful. Nights my second to last night and I'm going to sleep and just like recharge. Sorry about this terrible lighting, but I will see you guys in my next clip. Hello everybody. It's about 11:30 here. In Atlanta, today is day four slash night five, and it's actually my last day here. My hair's a mess, my makeup's beat. Um, as I think you guys yesterday's clip, I, my photographer that I shot with yesterday, we were kind of rushed and finished all the shots that we were wanting, and so he told me to come back today at 11, um, but... It's gloomy as hell. Today is extremely dull and that the pictures wouldn't look very good. So. Hey guys, what is up? Sorry for this terrible lighting, but I just got to the Cumberland Mall again. This is a quick outfit of the day. My Dior Attic shirt, cycle shorts, Gucci fanny pack, and Yeezys. Hair and bun again, because I'm lazy. But we'll go ahead and vlog in here a little bit. Like an hour ago and just got through security and I'm heading to my gate. 